Hello, Collective, wherever you are. Hope you're someone safe, someone's warm, surrounded by love, light, happiness, joy, abundance, and filled with so much faith. Real quick, can you do me a favor? Can you hit that like button? Please hit share. Um, and hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on to all. So you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you would like to donate, you do not have to. It's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. Um, the information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of, but with all my heart ahead of time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so. And to everybody who has been. Thank you, thank you, thank you. May God uh, bless your beautiful souls tenfold. All right, guys. I apologize, uh, Clyde was like, you know, kind of jumped on these cards, but, um, yeah, if you didn't see part one and two, watch that, this is, I'm just like, you know, doing the last few cards here, because there's sword space ran out, so, um, Clyde's acting up a little bit, so, I just want to get this reading done with real quick, so I can start your next one, too, but yeah, the bottom of the deck was, you're getting justice, okay, um, bottom of the deck is, you know, queen of cups is you and they're in their, so you have people in their past that are in their head they can't sleep at night about this but you getting this justice and the justice system seeing you as this divine being that you truly are very loving very nurturing very caring and about you getting this passionate new beginnings um and whatever you're planning okay and these people are like planning to come up against it but it's not working okay they're not getting victory and success over uh this death magic they sent to you to you know whatever you're doing and to steal whatever this is they're trying to do some sort of destiny swap that's just not happening they're trying to steal your ultimate wish fulfillment none of that's just happening all right you're getting it's this group called coven secret society where the fuck it is um yeah you're you're getting your justice you're getting your ultimate wish fulfillment these people use karmic family and everybody involved in this situation is going to exactly where the fuck they uh they deserve to go and they're getting what they deserve while you get your what you deserve ultimate wish fulfillment and everything else holy spirit divine spirit angels ancestors love has passed away what is the collective you're gonna have a reason to celebrate we have the three of cups here oh wow there's yeah you're gonna have a reason to celebrate um somebody from your past is coming back it's not a bad energy it's a good energy i feel like it's a child There's a child that's coming. You're getting some sort of justice order or something, maybe with a child. This could be like a um, custody battle or something. But you're also going to be get um, something about a child here. You're going to get back. It, it doesn't even really have to be. A, it might be a custody battle. Um, it doesn't even really have to be a custody battle. It could even just be these people in your Clyde. You all right, babe? Sorry, guys. This is what I mean. So I want to hurry and get it done because Clyde's like getting into things. But um. Yeah, so there, it doesn't even have to be so much a, a custody battle. It could even just be, uh, like, you know, if someone lied, these people, this cult coven or whatever, a secret society, like, turn, or, or an ex or whoever, turn your, your child against you or fill their head with lies and betrayals or whatever, they're, they're gonna, um, this is getting situated. But there is also somebody, it's something about a custody battle. You're getting, you're gonna win. You're gonna win this custody battle or, or whatever this is here. Something about that. But you're also gonna have reason to celebrate because you just, you're getting justice over these people from your past that are in this group cult coven that were coming up against you. But there is something here about a child as well. Or children. that a karmic family member or somebody or an ex or something might have taken custody or illegally took custody or like did something to the justice system lied to the justice system to to get this custody or something like that the child might even be a little bit older now but it does as i'm saying it doesn't have to be in the in the justice system but i feel like maybe when maybe there was some lies being told back in the day to get this custody of the child if that is the case something like that's happening here all right, but you're going to also have reason to celebrate because you're you're getting justice from these people in the past um, that were in this group called Coven that were coming up against you. Thirty six can definitely be significant. Ninety seven can be significant, and ninety six can be significant. 96 can definitely be significant because 96 here and 96 here. It's like mirroring numbers. All right, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. Yeah, you're protected and you're protected from these people in the past too. Holy Spirit, Divine, and your like celebrations are protected as well. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, angels, and ancestors, and the passed away. What does the collective need to know? What they need to be aware of? Or what's the outcome? I'm sorry. What's the outcome of the situation? Please, thank you. They try to get you trapped. 
they try to get you imprisoned um false allegations to, to steal your ultimate wish fulfillment the justice system knows about this there's somebody in the justice system too that's trying to be released from prison so they're telling on everybody but they're not it's a karmic family member they're not getting his victory they are telling on these people though from the past but they're not getting out of prison should i should i say that um we'll just say <laughs> I don't know what she said, but um, we'll just say there's somebody that's a karmic family member. I believe there's someone you consider to be family that's locked up, that's in it's in jail. They or they're in custody now or something like that. They could be on house arrest or something. I don't know, but they're um lo they're locked up. They're they're telling everybody to get out of prison. We'll just say okay. Um, it's not going to go in their favor. <laughs> You're getting your justice though. They are bringing your justice. But they were trying to get you also, their idea was to get you locked up. They lied, to, they made some false reports. They're heavily burned about this, like, false reports that they made um, to the justice system about you. Somebody, this, I guess, group cult, secret society coven, they didn't realize that, you know, that whatever lies they made to the justice system to get you locked up was going to, you know, bite them in the ass later. Because that's false, you know, false information to a police officer. It's, that's a bunch of shit. That's a bunch of shit. Hold on, guys. All right, I apologize, guys. Um, Clyde, <clears throat> I had to, you know, uh, attend to Clyde, my kitty kitty. But, yeah, so they're not, um, yeah, there's somebody in, like, your karmic family member or something like that, or someone you consider to be family, or it's a karmic family. Um, there's somebody that's locked up in jail now that's going to, that's planning on telling on, that, no, they did, they already did tell. But um, there's also like a karmic family that made a lot or someone in your family that's a karmic that lied to the justice system about you to try to get you locked up. But you're not getting they made false allegations. There was like a lot of shit going on here. Um, they could uh, they're, they're going to get charged for this. They don't I don't think they see this coming. They might have thought they got away with this, but they didn't. They did this so they could steal your destiny, steal whatever, like, was left to you or whatever this is to get your ultimate fulfillment or something. Or if it's, like, a, you know, inheritance, to steal this inheritance from you. But, yeah, they're, they're not getting victory over this. It has to do with money. It's an inheritance, I already know. The justice system also knows about them um, doing this. They were planning on either getting you locked up or because they tried to attempt to unalive you and they were unsuccessful at this. They know about all this. Because there's somebody on the inside that's locked up that's um, either somebody you consider to be family or it's a karmic family member or something like that that's trying to get out of prison that's telling on everybody about this whole situation. Yeah, God stepped in on this shit. It's in God's hands. This is that card. This deck has the two extra cards in it. I already, I already I explained it in every reading. Um, this one, I, I set the attention. You know, it just shows you how to do the Celtic cross spread, but I set the intention where God stepped in is in God's hands. And then this one is the other one. I set the intention and I wrote Twin Flame on there. All right. So, for people that, uh, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, Love and Passport, what is the outcome of this situation? Please, thank you. Wow. You're getting a major payout from this. Whatever they stole from you was a lot of fucking money. We have the Ace of Pentacles, and it's over top of the justice. Is the over the, the justice? You're gonna have a reason to celebrate. You're getting some major payout. Whatever they stole from you was a lot of money too. You're getting this back, and you're also gonna be get, you're gonna be suing either the justice. You're gonna be suing these people. Somebody might even be suing the justice system, or the justice system might be paying you. Um, oh, there was that crooked cop involved. Or crooked law enforcement. Somebody, you might be suing the justice system. Or it's just part of your justice that you're getting. You know. Because um, you're going to be suing these people. That tried to. This group called Coven. That tried to falsely. Um, to try to get you like. You could have been also falsely arrested before. You're getting paid for that too. Somebody did. Somebody was. Um, got locked up. Like was like false imprisonment. You're going to get a payment for that. That's not for everybody. But that is for somebody. They were trying to block this new beginnings for you, from you. That's why they were doing it, so they can steal it from you. But your money is protected, whatever they stole. Because they did steal it, but they but you're getting it back. They thought they stole it. They got it. They did. They they, they were spending everything on your money. So, you know, they were using your money to pay people to come up against you. Um, but they were being watched doing this. Or, like, this person, they were either... Well, they were, because even after... 
they might even for some situations they knew the just system knew but like i said they were just like you know before in, in the other you know the other parts the one or two i think it was um the just system knew about this they already knew there was something shady going on there watching it okay and they just wanted to, they had other things they had to tie up first and they were surveillancing them watching them do this also there's somebody for another situation there was um you know they like they got the money first but then somebody in jail that's looking at a lot of time is trying to release himself from, they want to be free from prison so they went and they're telling on everybody about everything about pay like a major they paid somebody a lot of money to unalive you too like it might be that hitman that's what i'm strongly getting or it was just that hitman that was undercover that they paid they went they went on the dark web and ended up fucking around and the rest and they got a cop and it wasn't you know that where the hitman got pulled over or some shit and they're locked up and they're trying to get out so they're telling on everybody But you're going to have reason to celebrate because you're going to get a major payout. You're going to get a major payout. You're suing all these people from your past. Screw Cole Coven. All right. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. And it's going to be like a major payout, let alone whatever they stole from you, too. Yeah, house. You're getting fucking money and a whole house here. It's coming in quick. You're going from the Five of Pentacles. Like, you could possibly be in the Five of Pentacles now. You don't have to be. But you're, what I'm strongly getting is this is like you're going from the Five of Pentacles. You're coming out of that and you're quickly coming into this. You know, you're having your own in your home, own home, possibly a business. You know what I mean? And it's like a or it's like a backfire. Like somebody's stole your house. They're going from they're they're like you're you're coming from the five pentacles and quickly going into like you know having going from you know if you are if you don't own your own home or if you're like homeless or if you're staying like with somebody else or something like that you're coming out of that quickly. Um, or even if it's just that you rent your home, you're coming out of that situation and rapidly going into your own to be in the owner of your house. You know you're owning your own home. Because you're getting some major payout and either a house was left to you or you're going to end up being able to buy your own home and own your own home with whatever this payout is. And people are, of course, doing some bullshit. They're you know, obsessed with trying to block this and trying to, um, but they're not able to. It's already like the decision has been made by God and now it already happened in the 5D and um, it's trickling down to the 3D now and people are already, you know, the moves, like the justice knows about everything. They're just finishing up. You know, all the loose ends because these people, there's a whole group called Coven. There's a bunch of people involved. There's a lot of shit going on. You're not the only person they did this to. They do this to people. So that's why there's so many different scenarios here because um, it's not just you. It's a bunch of people they do this to. So, like, you know what I mean? So they have to, like, bring justice to everybody. You know what I'm saying? So they're they're just... They're doing their job. They're doing it the correct way. And just trust me, your patience and, and your faith is going to pay off tremendously. Holy Spirit, that's what it is. Yeah. The person that's in jail, that's in prison, they're they're having a horrible time in prison. They're not. And I feel like this person, too, is like more of like a free. They, they might have possibly been in jail, in, in and out of jail. And they thought, it, like, they didn't think that they would care. That, and it's going to be a blind side to these people. Because these people from your past in this group called Coven, they thought this person that's, in, that's locked up is a whole G. Like, they're like, oh, no, no, we don't got to worry about that person. That person's like, no, they're in and out. They, you know what I mean? They're no. This person's having a bad time in prison they're having a bad time and they're looking at a lot of time in prison they're getting beat up in there they're getting people running in on them because god's making this like god's letting this happen because of it's a backfire from what they've done to you and plus all the magic that they were doing and everything is their time to reap what they've soon and, you know they like back in the day when they'd be in prison they were doing this shit to other people too and plus what they've done to you so it's their karma coming back to them they're older now right this person's like older and like people you know, they're not as hard body as they used to be. And they're in prison getting beat the fuck up. People are running down on them and everything else. So they're trying to get the fuck out. It's a karmic family member of yours. Or someone you consider to be family. Yeah, and so they're going to be blindsided when they find out about who this is. They're going to, this, this group gold coffin is going to be like, what the fuck? So-and-so did this? Are you fucked? They're not going to believe it. They're not, they're going to be shocked to find out that this is who's taking them down.
they're gonna be all they're gonna be completely shocked by this they never would have thought this person would have did this to them because like he's like an og you know what i mean like he's like he he had his respect and he's done so much time in prison but like i said this time is it's none of that no this time it, he's getting everything you know what i mean he's pc in himself he's in pc He's purposely getting put in a hole and shit because he doesn't want... He keeps getting beat up and, like, ran in on, like. And he just doesn't have it in him. He wants to get out. It's a masculine energy for sure. They're going to be shocked when they find out who the fuck this is. They're going to be shocked. They ne would have never thought... They would have never thought that this person would have did this to them. But it's their karma. And just like when these people get locked up, if they were in, some of them have never been to jail. Some of them have, some of them been in and out, and they're all thinking in the back of their mind, like, oh, if anything happens, like, I mean, it's just jail, it's just prison. Da, 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 da. They're still shitting bricks in the, in the back of their mind, but they're still, like, in a, they're still that part of their mind, like, whatever, I've been there before. To the ones that have, no, it's not going to be like that. They're going to have the same experience that this person that's happening now that's they're trying and that's what's going to happen to be a trickle down effect and while they're all in there they're all going to end up ratting on everybody else too on other situations too so it's like god's way of clearing out and getting a lot of people off the street off the streets and get them to stop from their evil ways you know what i mean and also get other people uh you know that are in this devilish energy, evil energy, like to stop and get them off the streets and also to get them to stop and be like, oh shit, like, all right, this is a new day. Like, we can't be doing this type of shit to people no more. You know, you see what I'm saying? You know what I'm, you know what I'm trying to say? But yeah, that's what's happening. Somebody might have got released. I'm sure only getting, like, maybe if that hit man, that's what I'm getting to. For that incident, like, for instance, like, the one that, it was actually a hitman that got pulled over on his way to do the job, or, you know, after they, they hired him, and it was an actual hitman, he got released out on bail. But it's only to, he got, or he's out on bail right now. People might not, I don't even think they know that this person got locked up for that incident. Talking about that situation, these, I don't think these people know. They don't even realize this person got locked up. They got out on bail. They, like, bonded out or pretended like it was bail or something like that. They got out, and they're setting these people up. Now, that's on another scenario. That's for somebody else in the collective. Now, you know what I mean? Like, because I said, the whole group, whole coven, there's a bunch of shit going on here. And they're like, oh, fuck no, I'm not doing the rest of my life in prison. Like, fuck these people. And they're that's what's happening. They they got out. They're either released on bail or, like, the cops just let them out to go set this, this group, whole coven up. Um, that's one scenario. That's for somebody in a collective. The other one, it's they're in prison. They've been in there for a little bit now. And mm -hmm. they want to get the fuck out because they're having, like, a horrible time. And it's somebody considered to be family. And there's also another scenario, too, guys, that somebody had a family member. Um, this is the only one I got the other day. And, and spirits tell me, yes, it is connected with this, too. Um, that their family member is a cop. And they're, they're thinking, oh, well, you know, they can always drop the cop's name. No, that's not working either they're going to be shocked it's like a sister or a brother that's a cop or something like that confirmation and that's not working no more and like the the the, the family member's tired of that that person using their name because it's making them look bad and they're not and it's just something like serious they're not letting them use up their name or or like whoever picked them up like the case just too serious and they're like no fuck that nope I don't give a fuck who your family member is. I don't give a fuck. If you're breaking the law, you're coming with me. And they're like, what? What? Yeah, like, what the fuck? And you're getting this beautiful um, light of cups here. You're you're getting a solid level for coming in, okay? Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and those passed away. What is the outcome, please and thank you? Damn, major towers to these motherfuckers, dude. Major towers. That karmic family... That came down. Everybody in this past, this this group whole coven, they're going through chaos, destruction, upheaval, mayhem. Because like I said, they're fucking telling on everybody. Like I'm telling you, some of them are unaware of what's going on. Some of them kind of know. They did know. They did get a message. Someone got a message somehow about somebody in the past. Like somebody, you know, getting locked up. They did find out and they, they realized that their, their whole world's coming, you know, crashing down. Somebody could have gotten into an accident. 
but their whole world is turned upside down. They, they're also, um, I feel like someone's trying to settle things outside of court with you. They're trying to come up with an idea to, because their whole world's coming and they know what it's hint for. But that's not even going to work, dude. Don't do a deal with these people. Yeah. People are losing homes, everything. Five of Pentacles, Eight of Wands. It's a backfire, bro. Four of Wands. You're going from, like, the Five of Pentacles. You're rapidly moving into this Four of Wands where you're going to own your own home, like I, like I explained. Also, somebody's leaving a house, and go. they're going from being, like, you know, probably your house. It's probably your fucking house. A homeowner to being homeless, but not really homeless because they're going to prison because they're getting out of your fucking house. They're obsessed with, you know, trying to block your new beginnings, all right? No, they abuse their power. They're doing some sort of fucking, like, magic or something to try to stop this. And this is what's making it speed up even more. Because the more they try to stop and they try to attack it, there's somebody... There's also a, somebody in devilish energy taking the stand. Like I said, it's this person in jail. They're still in devilish energy. They're taking a the stand and they're telling on everybody. Because it's really sticking out to me, like, how the devil's hand's sitting there. And it looks like he's on, he's on like, the... You know, he's, he's on oath, like, telling on everybody. It's a person that's in prison or the person that got locked up, um, the hitman that was coming to unalive you, and that got pulled over. But it, there, there's a couple different um, cases here. Because, again, it's a collective reading. You're getting whatever you're working on, keep doing it, okay? Because whatever plans you're doing, it's it's going to give you this passion new beginnings as well. Let alone, you know, the, this, whatever this is to keep working on whatever you're working on. Um, they're trying to, they're like, also, they can't sleep. They're, they're you know, up all night crying about your new beginnings and everything else. And then have to release this house that belongs to you. And about what you got going on and how you are this, this is definitely an ex. Um, about how you're this queen of cups and you're getting these new beginnings with somebody else and not them and how they fumbled the fucking the 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 ball with you they want to balance something out because they remember you being really generous to them and they know they see you hard working hard right but they try to sacrifice you they try to they try to sacrifice you and they worked hard to do this too but you made all the right sacrifices you had to in your life. You know what I mean? Like cutting these people off like God the sacrifices God told you to do. Like, you know, um, do you took some sort of sacrifice though? It was like, I don't know, either cutting these people off or something happened, which kind of felt like a tower moment recently. And you just gave the, the, you just gave it up to God. And because you did that, you sacrificed that, whatever it was. And like, you didn't let that tower moment take you down and you just gave the problem to God, and you the, you took a you, you took a hit somewhere in this. You might have lost out on property or something, but you were just you just trusted in God. You took that as like your sacrifice, like all right, well, whatever it is, what it is, you know what I mean. God, you know, take it over because you did that. You have no idea. You have no fucking idea how much that's going to pay off for you. All your, God's going to be like, you're, all your seeds are planting out too are flourishing uh, beautifully. And because you did that, you did it so angelically. All right. Maybe if you had like, I don't know, you could have lost property. Someone could have sold your car. You could have, you could have had like a car accident, but you looked at it as like a bigger, you could have got kicked out of a house or something or something like that happened. Somebody could have stole something from you, but you just, instead of letting it tear you down, you gave that problem to God, and you just like, all right, I trust that this was happening, okay? I trust that this was supposed to happen, and because you did that, dude, that's going to pay off. Like, it's, it's, that made everything even much faster for you, and it's like, your seeds are flourishing even better now. And it's even making you come into union. Look at this. What your divine, they're nervous. You're coming into union. It's your twin flame. They're nervous. It's, it, they're, they're coming with this, you know, solid love offer. They're a little bit nervous, but it's a good nervous. It's your actual true twin flame. They could definitely be famous. This is hidden from you. You don't know this is coming. They might be like a hidden star, like, or you don't, you don't know they're famous. It's a famous person. It's hidden. They're very powerful, very good looking. 
you're going to get a message you're manifesting this and they're coming they could possibly be through your leap of faith your new journey that you took that's how you're going to meet your emperor which is your divine counterpart and this ace of cups yeah your cups will be overflowing with love it's your good it's your good luck your good fortune um the wheel of fortune is in your favor you prayed for this it's coming in god heard your prayers you prayed for this god heard your prayers it's coming in they're watching you but they're watching you to protect you like they're there's they're watch they're protecting you in a 5d they're watching you but it's like a good watch like they're maybe if you have a platform or social media or something they're watching you and they're protecting you in the 5d at least they might be in 3d i don't fucking know um with your spirit your gift yeah someone's like trying to attack your spiritual gifts too but uh no they're trying to put an end to your spiritual gifts yeah they're they're trying they're trying to attack your you know whatever you're doing that's a big no no especially because you're in your purpose or you're on your way there someone's going to pass away because of doing this because you're heavily protected your way to protect it someone's going to pass away it could be this queen of wands here i feel like she should be in the reverse like i feel her energy it is she's a very manipulative fucking evil cutthroat bitch um nasty ass bitch that needs to go see a gynecologist you remember you know which one i'm talking about on it you can't even do it Woo! the teardrop absolutely not bitch like you gotta put a clothespin on when you're like any even like 30 feet in her fucking presence you wear a fucking whole like asthmat suit on with that bitch around gas mask and all like bitch go see a gynecologist yeah a source of truth come out about this bitch she's in great pain to our agony about you coming to union and getting this inheritance back that was stolen from you during deep emotional pain because god stepped in it's in god's hands and you are my darling the empress we're the emperor put the rules where they fit you're very creative very fertile um they're tr also attacking your fertility your womb and they're also trying to um attack your creativity and your fertility but that's protected you're protected keep your eyes on your goals because you're getting there okay so you heard everybody's fighting about this too about them being exposed it's dumbass leo and there he is right there his energy does feel better though or hers whatever it is their energy does feel better they're not the same way they've been they either passed or this is a new way like leo it's still a little stagnant in there but they're, they did change They've been exposed, probably because they're exposed. Maybe that's the one that's in prison. It's the completion's end of a cycle. Either they pass away, and they're just their spirits kind of lurking around a little bit. But if they've been like, you know, scared straight, I guess. I don't fucking know. Um, their energy is a lot more cleansed. It's a lot more. Maybe they finally took a shower or something. I don't know. They they're a lot more. Um, they're not as, you know, normally when that when this energy comes out because it is the same energy. It's just cleansed. It's you know what I mean. I just want to throw it because they're just like so they're not in that energy no more it's in completion end of a cycle of them smiling in your face tapping in your back because maybe they got locked up yeah maybe they got locked up the chariot here they either got locked up or they, this could be the hearse also you know taking the body to the morgue uh, it, that very well could be it because all these illusions they cast it could have been a backfire you moved away from these people or you're about to this whole anybody that grouped up with this with these people to come up against you to steal this inheritance from you they're being watched by the fetty wops whoop whoop son of police people are going down now you see now everybody's walking away from this king of clubs this um it could, they could be i feel like this should be it's your ex everyone's walking away from your ex possibly or um you know it could be this leo too there they should be in a reverse but i always keep my cards in the upper i could feel their energy it's definitely a reversal everyone's walking away from them I feel like it's your ex, though. That's crazy. But that's all I got for you guys. Um, yeah, either that that Leo is they either passed away or they're locked up. They could be locked up too, and now they're like what now that they're in prison. That could be the one that's in prison telling everybody. I don't fucking know. But um, uh, what do you call it? Maybe they're locked up and they're like, oh my god, I'm really here. Like, this is happening. And they did some real soul searching. Because that is the same energy, but I, I just can't tell if they passed away or if they just, like, they really start to heal themselves. But they might have passed. It's one or the other. Where'd that Leo card go? Yeah, because they've been exposed for who they are to end up a cycle of them smiling in your face, tapping in your back. So it's either they passed from all these illusions or they got locked the fuck up. It's one of the two. They could have been, that could have been the one that got locked up and then hurry up and they let out. And like nobody even knows that this person's locked up. Like it got locked up. You know what I mean? They hurry bailed themselves out or the cops just made it look like, you know, just let them out so nobody knew. Because they could have been like, well, if they know I'm locked up, they're going to, you know what I mean? Duh, 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 duh. So the cops could have just let them out. 
and they while like they realize oh shit why they're incarcerated in, in the fed rallies you know sitting there talking to the feds like oh shit this is very real you are very protected what do i need to do i need to change my fucking life they could even have like a um near-death experience got into a car accident i did say something about an accident they could have gotten to like a near-death experience and they could have seen god like well not in that energy though and out there dude see god but they, they could have seen an angel and an angel could have been like look this is what you got to do you need if you want to make this right you need to change your ways and maybe that's what happened because it is that energy but it's just not it's actually kind of pleasant now it's not that bad it's still a little eh. like i wouldn't trust that motherfucker if i were you i would not but um they're not it's not like i want to throw that card like i used to you know what i mean so i don't know someone is doing maybe that is i don't know Somebody did change, or they 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 transitioned one or the other. I just seen the Ace of Swords right there, so maybe that's what happened. I don't know, guys. Um, till next time, remember, God loves you. Said so why? Spread love, not hate, always. And um, do not, please, do not forget to give God, angels, ancestors, and loved ones that passed away the utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation, because they are moving mountains for us and getting ready to rain down miracles on us. Sorry, right, guys. All right, I love you guys. God bless.